As a lawyer and a New Yorker, I am proud to live in a city that takes care of its own. At Her Justice, we provide legal services to low-income women in crisis in the areas of family, matrimonial, and immigration law. Last year, Her Justice provided legal services to over 3,000 women and their over 4,000 children. Our clients are incredibly strong, and many of them have survived great hardship. What they don't have is access. Her Justice makes sure that our clients receive that access by connecting them with private attorneys from around the city so that our clients have access to the legal tools that give them safety, security, and self-sufficiency. We used to fight a lot, and he used to abuse me physically to a point that in more than one occasion I thought to end my life because there was not a other way out. He wanted my pension, 401k, medical benefits. He wanted my furniture at one time. It seemed like he was winning all along, you know? My client was arrested because her abuser had actually called the New York Police Department and alleged that our client was harassing him. My marriage was built on deceit and it escalated from verbal abuse to physical. Quería romper un ciclo que no era beneficioso para mí ni para mis hijos. Tú vas a salir de casa y y mi hijo se va a quedar en casa. itself. It is not being operated in a way that is helpful to the very people that it was set up to serve. While our clients may have compelling stories, it doesn't necessarily mean that their entire stories can be heard without a lawyer stepping in. When people go to courts and they don't have a lawyer, they come up short, even when the law's been designed to protect them. When we have 12 attorneys on staff who can then leverage the legal support from the private bar, we are able to represent and help over 7,000 people every year. Because of the law firms that donate their services to us and because of our people that within our walls are able to train them, help and represent our clients, that is how we are able to best serve the community. The work of Her Justice is vital to women who are not in a very empowered status. It can be very difficult for them to assert the rights that they do have. Her Justice empowers these women to understand understand that they do have rights. Many of our clients are completely in the dark about the financial circumstances of their marriage. We know that our pro bono attorneys can make the biggest difference in the lives of those clients by partnering often with financial accounting firms to investigate the income of the spouse and get the client a fair financial award. We'll look for hidden facts such as if a defendant's hiding income, hiding employment, hiding assets, and we use our investigative experience to get the information that's most helpful to her justice and the pro bono attorneys. Providing pro bono services means that I get to see those results on someone's face when they get an order of support or an order of protection to get them the financial means that they need to help raise their child or to get them safety away from someone who's putting them in danger. We know we have these incredible mentors, brilliant, talented, resourceful, responsive attorneys who sort of have our back on every matter. In my experience working with the attorneys at Her Justice, I have been so impressed by their dedication and commitment and, and the quality of service that they have provided to their clients. I actually grew up in foster care uh, in New York and as a child, I never had access to the quality of professional and legal services that Her Justice provides. I think her life is unimaginably different because she came in contact with Her Justice. She might have been deported by now. Instead, she has status and she's living with her daughter here. If I didn't have Her Justice there to help me with the case, I would still be married to the man who raped me and tortured me. The fact that Alice's husband was sentenced to 40 years in prison really speaks to the brutality of what Alice endured. Without her justice, Alice would have had to face her abuser in trial alone. Judge ordered that he does not get any part of my retirement or 401k or any medical or furniture or whatever he wanted. He's getting nothing. I was an illegal immigrant. I have a work permit now. The fact that I had a social security number and I was able to have a bank account to deposit my check. It was like I'm normal. I don't think I'll be who I am today. Confident, relaxed, secure, happy without 
Her Justice, my life would be totally different. As a lifelong New Yorker, I'm proud to be part of the Her Justice community, where we shift the power to the low-income women who call us every day, who are seeking to build safer and more secure lives for themselves and their children. Ha sido difícil los cambios, pero lo importante que tenemos es de la la tranquilidad y estamos saliendo adelante. Gracias a esta agencia, Her Justice. I want to thank Her Justice for the amazing team that inspires you to put your best foot forward. I want to thank Her Justice for giving me my life back. Give her opportunity. Horea. Dignity. Shivang. Give her courage. Her security. Access. Compassion. Un mejor futuro. A new beginning. Give her justice.